Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawag. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in, in which, which we partake of Christ, His sufferings are remembered. Our minds are filled with His grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord, Lord Jesus Christ, Christ you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit. God, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we to whom the incarnation of Christ your Son was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips. And my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate on the joyful mysteries. The first joyful mystery. The Annunciation Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. <coughs> Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. 
Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second joyful mystery, the visitation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and will be, forever. Amen. The third joyful mystery, the birth of our Lord. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be, forever. Amen. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O, o Holy Mother, Mother of God. God. Despise not, not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, Pray for us that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us let us pray. O God, who is only begotten Son, by his life, death, death and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant we beseech you that meditating upon this mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through Christ, Christ our Lord. Lord. Amen. To you, O blessed Joseph, we have recourse in our affliction. And having implored the help of your holy spouse, we now with hearts filled with confidence, earnestly beg you also to take us under your protection by that charity wherewith you are united to the Immaculate Virgin Mother of God and by that fatherly love with which you did cherish the child Jesus. Grant, we beseech you, that you will look down with gracious eyes upon that inheritance whom Jesus purchased by his blood and will succor us in our need by your power and strength. 
Defend, O most watchful guardian of the Holy Family, the chosen offspring of Jesus Christ. Keep us, O most loving Father, from all blight of error and corruption. Aid us from on high, most valiant defender in this conflict with the power of darkness. And, as of old, you did rescue the child Jesus from the greatest peril of his life. So now defend God's holy church from the snares of the enemy and from all adversity. Shield us ever under your patronage, that imitating your example and, and strengthened by your help, we may lead a holy life and die a happy death, and attain the everlasting bliss in heaven. Amen. Jubilee Prayer for the Golden Anniversary of the Dominican Province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life. His name of his love we strive to incarnate. O God the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you. Let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share with all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawa. Today is the feast of our Holy Father, St. Francis of Assisi. Giovanni Francesco Bernardo Bernardoni was born in Assisi in 1182. After a carefree youth with little meaning and purpose, he was converted to the Lord, left all his material possessions behind, and strove to conform his life to the poor Christ by simplicity of life and to the crucified Christ by his charity. Francis attracted man, many followers to his way of life, and in 1210, was fir his first rule was approved. In 1221, in the house of Cardinal Ugalino in Rome, he met St. Dominic, the only meeting of the two founders that is sufficiently attested by historical data. In 1223, he revised, his revised rule was formally confirmed, and a year later, he received a sp the special grace of the stigmata. He finally embraced Sister Death on October 3, 1226. The special celebration of his feast in the liturgy of the order expresses the bond which exists between the friars minor and the friars preachers, based upon that bond which existed between their founders. St. Catherine of Siena said of them, Truly, Dominic and Francis were two pillars of Holy Church. Francis with the poverty that was his hallmark, and Dominic by his learning. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Come, let us adore Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Come, let us adore Christ the King, 
who raises up the lowly. Come, let us sing to the Lord and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us adore Christ the King who raises up the lowly. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come, Come let us adore Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God, and we are his people, the flock his shepherds. Come let us adore Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness, when at Meribah and Massa they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Come, let us adore Christ the King who raises up the lowly. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, They are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us adore Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and will be, forever. Amen. Come, let us adore Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Please be seated. He was found just and perfect, and in the time of wrath was made a reconciliation. O God, you are my God, for you I long, for you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you, like a dry weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary, to see your strength and your glory. For your love is better than life, my lips will speak your praise. So I will bless you all my life. In your name I will lift up my hands. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed I remember you. On you I muse through the night. For you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you. Your right hand holds me fast. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now and will be, forever. Amen. God's praise was ever on his lips. He called upon the stars, spirits, birds, and all creation to praise the Creator. Bless the Lord, all ye works of the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, Bless the Lord. Nights and days, bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord. Raise and exalt him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. Ye springs, bless the Lord. Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. Ye dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Ananiah, Azariah, Mishael, Bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt Him above all forever. 
blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven, praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. The Lord raised up the lowly one and exalted him to the ends of the earth. Sing a new song to the Lord, his praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its maker. Let Zion's sons exult in their king. Let them praise his name with dancing and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in his people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory. Shout for joy and take their rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips and the two-edged sword in their hand. To deal out vengeance to the nations and punishment on all the peoples, to bind their kings and chains and their nobles and fetters of iron, to carry out the sentence preordained. This honor is for all his faithful. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Please stand.
Let us pray. Almighty God, you granted our seraphic father Francis the grace of conformity to Christ in poverty and humility. By walking in the path he trod, may we follow your son and be joined to you in love and joy. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your son, who lives and reigns with you in unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the beginning of the book of the prophet Jonah. This is the word of the Lord that came to Jonah, son of Amittai. Set out for the great city of Nineveh and preach against it. Their wickedness has come up before me. But Jonah made ready to flee to Tarshish away from the Lord. He went down to Joppa, found the ship going to Tarshish, paid the fare, and went aboard to journey with them to Tarshish, away from the Lord. The Lord, however, hurled a violent wind upon the sea, and in the furious tempest that arose, the ship was on the point of breaking up. Then the mariners became frightened, and each one cried to his God. To lighten the ship for themselves, they threw its cargoes in the sea. Meanwhile, Jonah had gone down into the hold of the ship and lay there fast asleep. Then the captain came to him and said, What are you doing asleep? Rise up, call upon your God. Perhaps God will be mindful of us so that we may not perish. Then they said to one another, Come, let us cast lots to find out on whose account we have met this misfortune. So they cast lots and thus singled out Jonah. Tell us, they said, what is your business? Where do you come from? What is your country? And to what people do you belong? Jonah answered them, I am a Hebrew. I worship the Lord, the God of heaven, who made the sea and the dry land. Now the men were seized with great fear and said to him, How could you do such a thing? They knew that he was fleeing from the Lord because he had told them. They asked, What shall we do with you, that the sea may quiet down for us? for the sea was growing more and more violent. Jonah said to them, Pick me up and throw me into the sea, that it may quiet down for you. Since I know it is because of me that this violent storm has come upon you. Still, the men rode hard to regain the land, but they could not, for the sea grew ever more turbulent. Then they cried to the Lord, We beseech you, O Lord, let us not perish for taking this man's life. Do not charge us with shedding innocent blood, for you, Lord, have done as you saw fit. Then they took Jonah and threw him into the sea, and the sea's raging abated. Struck with great fear of the Lord, the men offered sacrifice and made vows to him. But the Lord sent a large fish that swallowed Jonah, and Jonah remained in the belly of the fish for three days and three nights. From that belly of the fish, Jonah prayed to the Lord, his God. Then the Lord commanded the fish to spew Jonah upon the shore. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. You will rescue my life from the pit, O Lord. You will rescue my life from the pit, O Lord. Out of my distress, I called to the Lord, and he answered me. From the midst of the netherworld, I cried for help, and you heard my voice. You will rescue my life from the pit, O Lord. For you cast me into the deep, 
into the heart of the sea, and the flood enveloped me. All your breakers and your billows passed over me. You will rescue me from the pit, O Lord. Then I said, I am banished from your sight. Yet would again I look upon your holy temple. You will rescue my life from the feet, O Lord. When my soul fainted within me, I remembered the Lord. My prayer reached you in your holy temple. You will rescue my life from the feet, O Lord. Please stand. be with you and with your spirit a reading from the holy gospel according to luke glory to you o lord there was a scholar of the law who stood up to test jesus and said teacher what must i do to inherit eternal life jesus said to him what is written in the law how do you read it? He said in reply, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your being, with all your strength, and with all your mind, and your neighbor as yourself. He replied to him, You have answered correctly. Do this, and you will live. But because he wished to justify himself, he said to Jesus, And who is my neighbor? Jesus replied, A man fell victim to robbers as he went down from Jerusalem to Jericho. They stripped and beat him and went off, leaving him half dead. A priest happened to be going down the road but when he saw him, he passed by on the opposite side. Likewise, a Levite came to the place, and when he saw him, he passed by on the opposite side. But a Samaritan traveler who came upon him was moved with compassion at the sight. He approached the victim, poured oil and wine over his wounds, and bandaged them. Then he lifted him up on his own animal, took him to an inn, and cared for him. The next day, he took out two silver coins and gave them to the innkeeper with the instruction, Take care of him. If you spend more than what I have given you, I shall repay you on my way back. Which of these three, in your opinion, was neighbor to the robber's victim? He answered, The one who treated him with mercy. Jesus said to him, Go and do Likewise. 
The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat. Ang pagmamahal sa Diyos at pagmamahal sa tao ay pwede, hindi pwedeng ipaghiwalay. Tandaan natin yan. Once we try to separate the two things, we become hypocrites. Hindi pwedeng kapag ka ikaw po ay simba ng simba, pag uwi mo sa bahay, ikaw ay walang hiya. It should be integrated. Kung ano yung natanggap mo sa dasal mo at kung ano yung pinagdarasal mo at kung ano yung natanggap mo sa misa, dapat inuuwi. It should be integrated. Hindi compartmentalized. Dahil ang ibanghilyong binasa natin ay napapatungkol sa pagmamahal sa Diyos at pagmamahal sa kapwa. Loving God is actually, sabi nga, we cannot fully love God because it is God's initiative. Loving God is actually trusting God on our part. It is our response to His love. Sapagat ang Diyos ang unang nagmahal sa atin. What we can initiate is our love of neighbor. Pero madalas, mahirap kasing mahalin ang neighbor na hindi perfecto. Madalas ating naririnig yan sa mga tinatawag natin na mga gathering, mga charismatic gathering at sinasabi, God is good. At palaging sagot, all the time. Tapos all the time, God is good, God is good, all the time. Paulit-ulit yan. Kaso, pagpapalitan mo yon. kung halimbawa yung neighbor mo, your neighbor is good, <laughs> pag hindi ako itisismis, kung sabihin natin yung neighbor mo, yung asawa mo, my wife, your wife is good, uh, from time to time. Your husband is good. Uh, mm. Hindi sa lahat ng pagkakataon. Kaya nga, mahirap. Kaya nga, ang challenge ni Kristo, sinasabi niya, kapag tayo nagmahal, integrated, buo. Hindi mo pwedeng ihiwalay ang pagmamahal mo sa Diyos at pagmamahal mo sa tao. May isang experience ako na hindi ko makalimutan. Bagong ordain ako na pare. Bagong ordain. And this lady, sophisticated ang mukha. Alam ko mayaman. Siguro natuwa sa akin sapagkat bagong ordain ka. Fresh daw ang reflection mo. Father, ang galing-galing mo naman. Tinanong pa naman, ano yung, ano yung humili ko? Basta, Father, magaling ka. Invite ako sa bahay nila. O naman, pagka alam ko invitation na kainan, ah, hindi ko tinatanggihan yan. Gracia din yan. Pagdating ko sa bahay, ganda ng bahay nila. At meron siyang collection ng vintage cars. Mga chideng. Hingin ko sana yung isa. Pag-upo ko, sabi sa akin, sumalubong sa amin ang isang batalyon ng mga katulong. To be exact, mga around, walo ata yun. Sabi, handaan mo ng pagkain si Father. Father, anong gusto mo? Sabi, kape, Father. O, sige, pwede na kape. Pwede na yan. Habang naghahanda sila ng pagkain, natagalan ng konti. Siyempre, nilabas pa yung pagkain, galing sa freezer, palalamigin mo, inaga eh, ice yun. Tingin siya na tingin sa oras. Sabi, Father, nakakahiya naman sa inyo. Sabi ko, wala naman akong ibang gagawin. Dito lang kakain. Biniro ko ng ganun. Maya-maya, siguro nainip siya. Pinagalitan ang mga katulong. Minura. Para bang sa loob-loob ko na, pwede, kagagaling lang natin ng misa. Pwede maging pasensyoso naman. 
Kaya habang kumakain ako, eh, nakatingin sa akin yung mga katulong. Walang yang pari ito. Napagalitan kami dahil sa iyo. Imagine mo lang habang nakatingin ka, habang kumakain ka, nakatingin sa iyo mga katulong na masama ang loob dahil napagalitan sila dahil sa iyo. Kita niyo na yun? Kakaatin lang ng misa. Kumakamura ng katulong sa God hanggang laman. Kaya ito yung challenge ni Kristo sa atin. Integrate the mass, the value of the mass, the value of what you pray. Kaya nga sa kasuntong dito sa ibang hilibidasan natin, tinatawag natin na who is my neighbor? At tinescribe dito kung sino ang neighbor at kung ano ang neighbor. Sabi dito, yung neighbor mo daw, yung nangangailangan dito, yung naging biktima. Pero yung possibly din, and actually, ang neighbor din, iyong Samaritan. Una, sabi na natin, naawa yung Samaritan, the good Samaritan. Remember this, that compassion, naawa siya, compassion. Compassion calls us to be involved. Maging involved ka. It calls us to be generous of our time. It calls us to be generous even of our own resources. Kita mo, yung Good Samaritan, time, huminto siya, tinulungan niya. Time. Nilagay niya sa isang in, gagastos ka. That is why, if you want to be compassionate, be ready to be involved. Be ready to be generous. Hindi pwede yung, ay naku, nakakaawa naman, then you just go. Kapansin ninyo, if you want to be compassionate, be ready to be involved. Be ready to be generous of your time and even of your own resources. Actually, your whole being. Kaya yung mga naawa, di ba? Naku, nakakaawa naman. Anong gagawin mo? Paglalaanan mo ng panahon. Ganun ang tunay na compassion. Pangalawa, compassion goes beyond race, color, religion. It goes beyond that. That if you want to be compassionate with people, hindi mo titingnan, hindi mo titingnan yung kulay, hindi mo titingnan ang religion, hindi mo titingnan kung anong race man siya. Kita mo yung example ni Jesus Christ? The Samaritan actually, a Samaritan, are actually the traditional enemies of the Jews. Dalawang neighbor ang dinescribe dito. A neighbor who is in need and a neighbor who is your enemy but also capable of being good. Kita mo ang example niya, hindi Hudyo kundi isang Samaritano na kalaban na kalaban ng mga Hudyo. Because when you help people, it goes beyond race, color, even religion. Alam nga naman, kapag kami na disgrasya, tatanungin mo pa ba yan? Muslim ka ba? Ay, sige, bahala ka sa buhay mo. Ay, protestante ka ba? Ay, bahala ka sa buhay mo. No. Because it is in our being to help. Whether we like it or not, kapag ka merong need na tumulong, tumutulong tayo. Bakit? Naawa ka. That is why compassion goes beyond religion, race, and color. Nung na-assign ako sa Dabao, maraming nagtatanong sa amin o kinikwesto niya aming decision. Kasi yung scholar namin doon ay Muslim. Although hindi man niya tinapos kasi nag-stop din education ng kinuha. May nagtanong sa amin, bakit father yung scholar niyo Muslim pa? Meron naman mga katoliko dyan na deserving. Simple lang sagot namin, hindi ba pwede? Pwede, di ba? 
That is why when you help people, you, it goes beyond that. It goes beyond the religion. Remember this, two things. Compassion goes beyond religion, color, and race. And compassion always calls us, always calls us to what we call to be involved. And today as we celebrate the feast of St. Francis of Assisi, actually, traditionally, sa aming mga Dominicans, kapag ka kapiestahan ni St. Dominic, we invite a Franciscan sa misa. At kapag ka kapiestahan naman ni St. Francis, they also invite Dominicans. At kung titignan natin ang buhay ng dalawang ito, they have compassion. Mayayaman to. Si St. Francis ay mayaman. Si St. Dominic ay mayaman. And yet they gave up their wealth because they saw and have compassion and they want to be involved in helping renewing the church during that time. And their teachings, by the way, they embrace and it goes beyond race, religion, and color. Kaya nga ang Dominicans at Franciscans, kahit saan lupalop ka ng mundo, nandun, it goes beyond. So remember this, na kapag tinatanong kayo kung sino yung neighbor mo, those who are in need, and perhaps those neighbors also might be our enemy, but they are capable of doing good and of being compassionate. Kaya kapag nagtatanong kayo kung sinong neighbor ninyo, tumingin kayo sa tabi-tabi, nandyan lang yan sila. Sa atin din, let us be a neighbor, let us be compassionate. But always remember to be involved in your time, in your generosity of your time, resources, and perhaps your whole being. That is how it is to be compassionate. Let us all stand. Jesus invites us to make fervent petition to Him, to the Father, with confidence let us present our intentions. And for every petition we shall answer, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. For the Church, that she may always reflect the Spirit of Jesus, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the heads of all nations, that they may rule with genuine concern for the people they govern. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For those who despair of salvation, that their doubts may be resolved through faith in Jesus. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the Franciscan and the Dominican families, that faithful to the charism of their founders, they may give witness to Christ through a life of prayer, simplicity, poverty, and study. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For our personal intention, the intentions of this Mass, and for the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all of us gathered here, that we may live holy and simple lives, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. This we ask through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated.
Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands that have become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands that have become our spiritual thing. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. Lord, as we bring you our gifts, prepared us to celebrate the mystery of the cross, to which our Holy Father Francis adhered with such burning love. We ask this in the name of Jesus the Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. You will lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and eternal God, through Christ our Lord. You exalted your servant Francis through sublime poverty and humility to the heights of evangelical perfection. You inflamed him with a seraphic, seraphic love to exalt with unspeakable joy over the, all the works of your creation, branding him with a sacred stigmata you gave us the image of the crucified Jesus, of Jesus Christ our Lord. Through Him, the choirs of angels and all the powers of heaven, praise and worship your glory. May our voices blend with theirs as we join in their unending hymn of praise. Pinagpalang na paririto Sa ngala ng Panginoon Hosana, Hosana, Hosana sa kaitaasan Hosana, Hosana, Hosana sa kaitaasan Please kneel. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy therefore these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like a dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me.
Let us proclaim the mystery of our faith. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of His death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, Lord your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis our Pope, Socrates our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, may merit to be co-heirs to the life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through Him, and with Him and in Him. O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Amen. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Ikian mo po kami ngayon ng aming kakanin sa araw-araw at patawarin mo kami sa aming mga sala para ng pagpapatawad namin sa nagkakasala sa amin at huwag mo kami ipahin tulad sa tukso Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil, graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to the apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, 
and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will. We live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. My dear brothers and sisters, behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world, Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. 